Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. So this time uh, I'm going to talk about a different problem in Power BI like uh, and the problem is left alignment. So we all know that uh, in the card visual we are not allowed it to have the left alignment. So I'll show you an alternative way to get the left alignment if it is very important for you. Uh, so let's get started. So uh, the, here I have a table name information, so I'll start to uh, drag the table. So here is the name. It's taking long. Um, I'll convert it into slicer. Um, make the fonts a little large so that it will be easy for you guys to view. Um, okay, so. Now if I drag the information here and if I change it to a card visual so you can see that the first information is shown so if we use the slicer here so you can see that we make this big you can see that the alignment looks uh, the visual looks good right so the text are texts are looking good but uh, as you can see that there is no option for the left alignment in this visual. Uh, you can't, you don't have anything to format this, right? So if you look at general, there's nothing. At data level, there's nothing to align it. And in category, there's nothing to align it. So uh, this is the problem, right? So uh, one of the best solution uh, to get the thing done here is uh, and I like it the most. The, uh, the one thing that I do is I change the card visual to a uh, table visual. Uh, okay, so uh, it's pretty easy, right? So you can see that all the uh, <clears throat> values are now left aligned and they're perfectly good. So if you are having any doubt that people, I mean, like if someone wants uh, someone wants to use the card visual and that is the requirement uh, so using a table visual isn't that different right so uh, let me show you how okay so let me just give a background color to this uh, I'll change this to light orange okay yeah you can see this right so if you change this to a table visual let me make this the same height and same width and if I drag the information here, so you can see that there's not much difference to it. I mean, the font size is big, uh, so that is causing the issue. Let me increase the text size. Okay, so you can use increase the text type to bold. And uh, it looks somewhat different, but uh, it gets the job done. I mean, like you can align it to uh, uh, center also. You can align it anywhere in this uh, table visual. Okay, so and if you drag this long enough, then the long uh, lines will also be shown here perfectly. So I'm using short lines here, but uh, this will be a perfect way to get your job done. So if I do this, uh, I think this is header, right? Uh, let me white color. Let me turn it to white. White color. I turn it to white. So in this way, uh, you can get your job done, right? It's pretty easy and I'm getting an outline here so okay now I'll give it a background color And I'll change the 
fertig. So if I turn off the outline, so yeah, as you can see that now they look pretty similar and I know the card visual looks great but uh, since we don't have left alignment I think this is the best way to do it and it, pro it syncs with the slicer perfectly as you can see that and uh, I found it pretty handy to do so I think uh, might be a great help for you guys as well um, and there's more to it so if uh, you want this same card visual uh, you can also get it as a conditional formatting in the in the uh, card visual right so in the title you can use it as a conditional formatting and I think that will be also helpful for you so let me write a measure here so I think we need Amazing for the title. So in title you can align it anywhere. So if you write the major here, where is the title? Okay. Mm. Okay, you can always do first or last. It depends on so the slicer will change it anyway uh, if you don't have slicer then I don't recommend this but if you are using slicer to change the value uh, this is a good way to go start okay so if I do like this and you can see that it is aligned to the left let me hide that data label okay so and if I Increase the text size. So yeah, you can see that, right? So you can align it anywhere you like. So this is also a good way to get rid of the. You can resize it, and I mean, like, you're good to go. So this formatting for the title, yeah, you can use it in any visual, and I tried it, and it works perfectly. Uh, you can also write measures to get it done so uh, i'll talk more about the how to use measures on the coming video uh, for now uh, i think uh, this works pretty great and i hope this video helps you guys uh, thank you for watching keep loving me goodbye